Actually, you know what? Let's go for a... Whoa, what the... <laughs> Wait, look at the shell. Okay, so what are we testing this weekend? We're going to be testing out a new module called Immune Amplifier. Uh, this is what the Immune Amplifier looks like. And uh, taking a look at the description here. So it looks like we have different uh, stacks or something. It has effect limit 60, um, extra durability of 10%, a speed increase of 5 kilometers an hour. Um, but if you read the description, it's actually uh, quite in-depth. Okay, so it says here for every uh, 30,000 damage received, uh, your robot gets a small bonus to increase its durability uh, for the entire battle. Um, it also says uh, upon reaching 20 of the possible bonuses, uh, you are immune to freeze. And then when you reach, um, you know, 40 of the bonuses, you are immune to lockdown. And uh, 60, you are immune to suppression. Okay, so all of these effects, uh, you know, stay active until uh, you end up dying in that bot. And it also says here increases the durability and speed. Okay, so when installing uh, several of these, uh, you know, modules, so if you have three of them on your bot, uh, your uh, speed of receiving the bonuses increases, but the uh, maximum amount is not. Okay, so really complicated. Um, we're going to try it out. I actually have one on the Capri. I have uh, two on the Fenrir, and I have three on the Behemoth, as well as three on the Seraph and the uh, Angler. Okay, so game one, we have dropped in on Springfield map. And I've started with the uh, Kepri first. This guy in front of us is a scorpion, so I'm kind of keeping an eye on him. I'm going to be linking uh, to this guy over here. Let's try to hit uh, that Seraph. And uh, the scorpion as well. This guy's going to blink back though, for sure. The thing is, I know where he is at. We're going to hit him here. Get rid of him. Oh, come on. For real. Okay, he destroyed. He destroyed. Let's go this way. Let's see, what is this player in? That guy's gonna go in a flight. I think that's a harp, your siren, right? Yep. It's linked to this guy. Uh, these weapons definitely do a lot more damage than I remember. Um, but the first round of testing, as I said before, you know, usually too weak or too strong. Um, in the case of these weapons, they were definitely too weak. And now we're seeing the other side of the spectrum here. Um, let me link to this guy. He's trying to get this beacon here in front of us. Okay, last stand on this guy. Last stand on that guy. This guy's like, oh crap. <laughs> He's turning around and we're all like aiming at him. There we go. Let's use the heal. Let's link. Last stand on him. I'm looking to see how much damage these weapons do to a Skyros. Oh my gosh, look at his health. And do you think this is like the light version? How much damage does the heavy version do? Uh-oh, uh-oh, this guy's gonna get killed. Okay, so these guys actually got our home beacon here. Um, let me drop in with a Fenrir. Let's, uh, let's try to get this beacon behind this player in front of us. Yeah, they're going, they're going for the farm. I'm trying to, I'm, oh. <laughs> I was trying to get sneaky and try to get this beacon. They're all dropping in here now. Uh, let's do that. Oh, shoot. Am I going to get a heal here? Oh my gosh, that was just in time. But I lost a weapon. I'm gonna go for this guy. Um, okay, let's try the angler. So the angler, I have three of those uh, immune uh, chips, or at least uh, modules. Let's try to do damage to this guy.
Maybe I can kill this one here. I have to knock his shield down though. There we go. There we go. Uh-oh. Come on, I have to change this beacon. No! Heal! Oh, I need to use my ability. We got it, guys. We got it. We got it. Oh my gosh, they're all here now. Wait, I'm doing damage to all of them. Come on, come on, come on. Oh. Um, let's do the behemoth. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we just deleted like three guys there. I think they're going to drop in here again. Yep. Scorpion. Oh my gosh, this guy has half health already. Uh, no! Let's do that. We got it, guys. We got it. I kind of want to actually ditch this, but... Oh, wait. There's a guy by... There's a guy by center. Um, let's use the, uh... Let's use the serum. He just landed, too. Those are really bad weapons. Okay, so I think that might be his last bot, right? Nope, they have another. Another one, another one! <laughs> maybe, maybe the other guy has also another bot. He might drop in on the other side for the dam. Steal it! Oh! We try to get that kill. Now he has an Ares. Uh -oh. Did he just go in a phase shift? He did. Wow. <laughs> that guy just got wiped out. Let me guess. I have another one? I think that's going to be it. Okay, so, you know what? I'm going to change up some of my weapons. I want to try the new weapon on the Behemoth. And uh, after that, I'll see you guys in game number two. Okay, so game two, we have dropped in on Canyon Map. And I've started with the uh, Skyros here. We're going to move this way. Oh, he didn't see me. I could totally see this uh, this build working too. The Seraph's going to go into flight. We're going to move this way. Actually, you know what? Let's go for a... Whoa, what the... <laughs> Wait. Look at the shell. This guy actually died, but he's still there. He's still standing. What? That is so weird. Dead corpse. Come on. Ah. I should have gone into uh, ball mode, but we actually did a lot of damage there. Okay, let's drop in with the uh, the Kepri. Where is this guy? I'm trying to see how much damage uh, these weapons do to a Skyros. Um, I kind of want to link to that guy, but he's uh oh, we can hit this player. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Is that all from me? Seriously? Man, that's pretty crazy. You know what? This might be a counter to Skyros too, because he seemed like he was taking actually quite a lot of damage. We've got a, a jumping Skyros on this side. Uh, this guy's almost down to his last stand. I'm going to move this way. Last stand on him. Where's my teammate? He doesn't have another ability. There we go. I think he might drop in on this side, right? Maybe. Maybe. 
trying to get close to my teammate here. Oh, he got killed. Let's hit this guy. There we go. Uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> he actually jumped. But the thing is, if he jumped, I know he doesn't have a heal. So he's probably going to attack me pretty soon here. When he sees his health dropping like that. We're going to see him go into the weapons mode soon. Just link to my teammate. Yep, there we go. That's going to kill him. So I actually put these weapons on the behemoth. I'm going to run that actually next. I want to see how much damage it's going to do. Uh, let's try to hit this guy. Oh my gosh. You know what? The new angler bot, that's definitely going to be the meta. I can, I can already see it right now. It's doing really well overall. It's kind of like how the Ravana used to be. Okay, let's try let's try this Behemoth build. Oh man, this is gonna do so much damage. If I get a player with this, it's gonna be lights out. Oh, they got me with a gravity amp. I gotta stay near this uh, Shuranga. There's another guy over here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's using his ability. No! Oh! No! No! He's looking at me. There we go. I need to reload quickly. Really want to get that Titan though. Uh, no! And this one. Oh my gosh. But that's not all from me though. He's getting hit by <laughs> like four players. Oh wait. We got to get that Arthur. Let's get the Arthur with this. Oh, Arthur! <laughs> Maybe if I drop down to the bottom because you'll have like elevation and... Oh, wait! This guy! Dude, that's like half his health. <laughs> He's looking around. I gotta get this Arthur though. I think this Arthur... Oh! I guess we'll deal... Holy crap, my health, my health, my health. I shouldn't have done that. And now he, <laughs> he faced... That was actually perfect timing because I used my heal. So now I can't heal. I actually really wanted to go for the Arthur though. Well, we have two of these weapons. I tried to see if I could curve it around the corner. Um, I needed to be more behind cover there. Okay, let's drop in with the uh, the Angler. Also, guys, I did do a video on this robot. Um, it was about a week ago or so. Uh, if you happen to miss it, definitely check it out. I'll leave a link actually to that uh, in the uh, video description. Let's try to see if we can get close to uh, this guy here. And uh, yeah, let me know what you guys think of the immune uh, amplifier. I definitely noticed my bots being a lot weaker, but that's because I don't have the uh, repair amplifying stuff on. Yeah, this guy is definitely dead. I think that might be his last bot, right? When it comes to testing modules like this, usually what I do is I test it on the bot. Sometimes it's really noticeable. Uh, in this case, I'm finding my bots a lot weaker. Um, not because it's like a lower level. I can just usually tell. And I think it's because I don't have repair amplifiers on. So I think you kind of have to make that sacrifice, um, you know, when it comes to 
do you want to be immune from something or do you want like more resistance but anyways let me know in the comment section below what you think of this module and uh, with that said thank you guys for watching and until the next video i'll catch you guys later